Hi. Hi. If you are ever asked a question, who is the most precious person in your life? Or whom do you value the most? You all might answer. My partner, my child, or perhaps my parent. All these people mean a lot to you. But there can be times when even they can let you down. Anyone can leave you. The only person who can never leave you is you. So you can always trust yourself. You will always be the one in your company. You can be your best friend. It is up to you whether you want to cheer yourself up or feel miserable. All you need to do is to just take care of yourself. You need to stay as healthy as possible. It may sound bitter, but the reality is that you cannot cure all your illnesses or your disability. But it is in your hands to live your life to the fullest. You can learn to lessen your symptoms in the best possible way. I do that every day. This is my personal experience. There are many things that you can do to help yourself and feel better. All we require is patience. Therapies can take time to be effective since we are different individuals and we respond differently to different treatments. There are many self-help techniques which are really effective and just try doing them. It is worth learning them. If you are getting negative thoughts, the simplest way is to try to imagine throwing all such negative thoughts and pain into the bin and get rid of them. Such technique is called visualization technique. Likewise, you can imagine almost anything you wish. Just let your imagination fly. Think of yourself being strong as a leader, as someone who can make it to the top of the mountain. Or just imagine yourself lying on a beach, sunbathing, and the sun's energy traveling into each part of your body, making you feel warm and energized. It can give you an amazing feeling. You may be able to actually get all the benefits of it happening in real life. It will teach you how to relax. And with all this, your sleep cycle can also improve. But just try to love yourself. Nurture yourself. Try to develop an interest or a hobby. When someone works hard, it is much easier to be complimented. But no one will compliment you for your efforts. It is only you who can praise yourself for your efforts. Nobody will praise you for coping up bravely with your challenges. This only you can do. Just repeat these words to yourself every day. Bravo. Well done for coping up with your condition so well. Praise yourself for any little achievement of the day. No matter how small. Even let it be making a cup of tea for yourself or cleaning your bed or just grooming yourself or just a simple bath. Sometimes it is very difficult. Feel more positive each day than the previous day. And congratulate yourself for feeling in such a way. Exercise regularly. This can help you. Though you may feel stiff or lazy, but it is still worth trying. Do some exercises, but do not overstrain yourself. You may not see its immediate benefits, but it is definitely going to work in long term. Lack of energy can be changed to an energized feeling if persistent efforts are made. It is also important to follow a healthy diet and keep a check on your weight. I know when there is a physical disability, you are not able to move much, there can be an increase in weight. All the food groups should be included in a balanced way in your diet. 
proteins are must so never forget that you are the person who matters the most never forget to praise yourself even for your tiniest achievement and i bet that you can do it you can cope cope up well with your condition cope up well with your chronic illness or disability i do that every day